Hey everyone, Gigi here with Spirit Readings and I'm so glad that you're able to join me here today. We are going to do the third eye chakra long distance Reiki session. You guys, um, I'm so excited for this, you know. So far we've worked on our root, sacral, solar plexus, heart, and throat chakras and today we're going to focus on our third eye. You know, I always like to check in with my pendulum, Ostra, here to see how mine is working. All right, Ostra, third eye. All right, there we go. Looks like mine is open. You know, it's going clockwise here. So you always want to pay attention to that. You know, if it's swinging back and forth or if it's going counterclockwise, you know, there could be some imbalances there, you guys. And, um, you know, I always like to take a moment, you know, to ground and center myself before we dive in. So, I ask that my third eye chakra be opened so that I can see all visions with crystal clarity. Yes, all right, powerful. Um, you know, you guys, the third eye chakra is also called the brow chakra. And the color that's associated with this chakra is indigo. It's located in the center of our foreheads. And the purpose of this chakra is insight, mind development, and action of our ideas. When it is out of balance, you know, we could fear the truth. We could lack discipline, judgment, evaluation, emotional intelligence, or, you know, our concept of reality would be greatly affected and we could find ourselves being very confused. Now, these can show up in our lives as brain tumors, strokes, blindness, deafness, seizures, learning disabilities, spinal dysfunctions, panic, depression, and, you know, headaches or migraines, you guys. Our spiritual lesson is one of understanding, reality, detachment, and having an open mind. Some good crystals for this chakra are purple fluorite, sugalite, lapilajuli, and amethyst. Um, you know, if you have, like I have amethyst and lapilajuli right here that I'm going to set around me for the sacred time. And I also have my chakra, my Reiki chakra stone here that's for the third eye specifically. Now, if you don't have any of these, but you have a clear quartz, you guys, you can use a clear quartz in the place of any other crystal. Um, some flower essences are wild oat, queen anne's lace, and dried mugwort. Um, some good incenses are jasmine or pine. You know, you could light a purple candle during this sacred time and place it in front of you. You can take whatever crystal you are drawn to and place it to the center of your forehead between your brows. You know, remember to take your time. You don't have to rush this, you guys. And, you know, during this, if you do place a crystal or if you just place one of your hands um, on your brow chakra, you know, you may start to warm up, vibrate, tingle. If you are holding a crystal, it may start to warm up, vibrate, and tingle because this is energy. Now remember, we're going to take some deep breaths in and deep breaths out if you need to envision smoke or light. You know, whatever it is that you need to do, you guys, you customize this. You make it fit you personally. And, um, you know, then we release fully. And if um, it needs to come out as a sigh, then you let that sigh come out. If it needs to come out as a scream, then you go ahead and let that scream come out because this is releasing fully here, you guys. And this is our sacred time. So, um, and the power of three, you guys, is, is generally how I do this. All right, so I'm going to take in place the, my uh, chakra, my Reiki chakra stone on my third eye. <sighs> oh. 
I am calm and clear. I open to the wisdom that dwells within me. I trust my intuition and follow it. I am connected to my higher self. I am the witness. I envision a world of peace and beauty. I release all attachments to wanting it my way. I see. I am calm and clear. I open to the wisdom that dwells within me. I trust my intuition and follow it. I am connected to my higher self. I am the witness. I envision a world of peace and beauty. I release all attachments to wanting it my way. I see. Oh man, that feels so good. <laughs> I am calm and clear. I open to the wisdom that dwells within me. I trust my intuition and follow it. I am connected to my higher self. I am the witness. I envision a world of peace and beauty. I release all attachments to wanting it my way. I see. And so it is. Blessed be. All right, you guys. Wow. Ooh. All right. Gonna take Astra again. Astra, my third eye. Yes. Okay. Still a little more open here now, you guys. Wow. I feel, I feel so good after doing that. I hope that you guys feel great, feel good, feel more open um, and in balance here. Um, I, I'm so grateful and thankful to each and every single one of you who have been going along on this journey with me. Um, it'll probably be something I do once a year, probably as I'm led by spirit or you know, um, I do offer Reiki sessions. If anyone is interested, all you have to do is email me. Um, you know, but I, I also like to show people how to empower themselves. You know, you know, physician, heal thyself, you know. So that's one of the goals for me. All right, you guys, I hope that you have a wonderful day. I hope you enjoyed this. Please leave me a comment and let me know. Um, next Saturday um, is our last chakra. It is the crown chakra. So I'm looking forward to that. And I hope that you guys are as well. Um, I do take the time to read through all of the comments and respond and answer any questions that there may be to the best of my ability. If you did enjoy this, please smash the heck out of that like button, that old thumbs up button, you know, give it the old razzle dazzle pizzazzle there. Please subscribe if you feel led to. I would love and appreciate that so very much, you guys. Um, you know, I love seeing growth. I love seeing expansion. And I love being able to interact with you guys on a regular basis. It really does bring a lot of joy into my life. Uh, you guys, you're a blessing for me. And I want to be a blessing for you in return. And please share because this does help me grow. That does help me get out there. And if you do decide to subscribe, make sure you tap that bell icon so you get the ding ding when I upload new content. You guys, you are so wonderful and so amazing. And I love and appreciate each and every single one of you. And from the bottom of my heart, I want to say thank you, blessed be, namaste, and goodbye.